Good morning guys! I'm coming to you from a very different setting than usual, and that's because today I am actually leaving my apartment! As you can see, I've got a lot of roots coming in and my hair, and it is time to do something about it. Uh, usually I go to my amazing, fabulous hairstylist friend Amanda, who, you know, does my whole head of hair for me, she bleaches my roots, she colors the rest of my hair, she doesn't have um, a time slot open where she can do my entire process for me. So today I will be trying a little something different. So she's bleaching my roots for me and then I am going to come home and apply the dye myself. So right now I'm in the car, I'm going to head to Amanda's and I will see you there. Alright, well I just made it to Amanda's. I've got a little bit of time before it's my appointment, so I thought I'd just check in and say hey and ask you guys how you're doing. I hope everyone's doing well out there. I've definitely had a pretty stressful last couple of weeks. Um, if you've watched any of my previous videos, you probably know that I am in the middle of moving or Possibly when this goes up, I will already be in our new house, so I've been pre-filming as much as I can so that I don't have to take any kind of break or hiatus in between the apartment and the house. So I've been working and working and working and filming to get these videos out for you guys. So it'll be nice to come and get my hair done, just sit and chat with one of my good friends for a couple of hours. Um, Looks like I can probably head in now, so uh, I will see you inside. So I just pulled up to my apartment. My roots are definitely bleached, looking a little bit like Draco Malfoy here. So I am just going to head inside and get right to work on applying the hair dye. I will be using uh, Virgin Pink from Arctic Fox to dye my hair myself. I borrowed a little brush and a dye bowl from May. Thank you, May, for assisting me in this. So I'm just gonna get right to it and hope for the best. Okay, so here I am, ready to go. I've got my little bowl and my brush. I have my Arctic Fox hair dye in the color Virgin Pink, which should hopefully match my hair just about perfectly. Um, I've got some gloves here. I've got on an old shirt that I don't care if it gets dye on it, and I've got uh, towels all around me. And please uh, ignore the mess that is the room behind me. I am in the middle of moving right now, so it's kind of a wreck. Please just focus on the possible crime that will be committed in the forefront of the image. <laughs> okay, so I am just going to slap on these gloves and get to work. Thank you. 
right, so the dye has definitely been applied. Uh, I didn't show it on camera, but I did have to ask my husband to come and do the back of my head. I just wanted to make sure that my roots were totally saturated, but then I just applied the rest with my hands, so hopefully that works out okay. Now I'm going to follow the directions and let this sit for about 30 minutes, and then we will rinse it out and see what I've done. Here we are now in the bathroom. I am ready to rinse out this color. I'm going to save myself some embarrassment of having you see me struggle to bend over the edge of the tub and rinse this out. So I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse it and then I will use some conditioner and we'll go from there. And just by the way, this is the conditioner I will be using. This is from the brand Olaplex. This is a brand highly recommended by my hairstylist Amanda. She swears by it, and I honestly do as well. I will be using another product from Olaplex in this whole process, but if you have colored hair, this will save your hair from a lot of breakage and help keep your hair strands strong through the damage of bleaching and dyeing. Rinsing is complete. I've got the goofy hair towel wrap going on and something that's really important if you have colored hair like I do is you need to be using cold water to wash your hair. If you would like to have brightly colored hair, gone are the days of enjoying a nice hot shower on your scalp. You will be using ice cold, as cold as you can possibly handle water to wash your hair. So I'm just letting the towel soak up a bit of the extra moisture, and then I will be adding another product from Olaplex that will help protect my hair from heat damage and also give it some nice shine. And that is going to be this product right here. As you can tell, I've gone through quite a lot of it already. Uh, this is again, of course, from Olaplex. This is their bonding oil. This I always apply when my hair is still wet. I will run it through with my fingers and then comb it through as well just to make sure it is evenly dispersed. But like I said, this is just gonna protect my hair uh, from the heat I'm applying from the hair dryer and also give it a really nice shine. Okay, here it is all blow dried. I am really happy with the color just looking at it right here. I think I'm gonna go ahead and like style it just a little bit and I'll put something on, you know, not like a Parks and Recreation Harvest Festival t-shirt and uh, I will see you guys on the sofa. Ah, there we go. That's better. Some sort of real clothes, still a comfy sweatshirt, but at least it's cute and pink now. So yeah, I am really happy with the way this turned out. It looks nice and even, the roots are obviously gone, and I feel like my hair looks really healthy and shiny, and I am just really happy with the way this turned out. I think this was a nice alternative to the usual full length appointments I do with Amanda. I love getting to go see her and catch up, but with it being the pandemic, it is nice to cut down your exposure to other people as much as possible. So usually a process like this where she bleaches my roots and colors my whole head takes around four hours, and this appointment only took two hours. And using the Arctic Fox hair dye was really easy. I'm sure I didn't make the process look super easy when you were watching me doing it, but it didn't feel very hard to do and it smells really, really good. I usually use Overtone to color my hair, which is twice the price of this. It has this really strong, like minty smell that just like stays in the back of your throat. I don't know what it is. Like it smells fresh at first, but then you're like, I can taste that. So I think Arctic Fox is a great choice if you're looking to color your own hair. It smells great. It was like $17 for this at Ulta. I was able to do my whole head and I have a decent amount left in here. So if you're looking for hair dye, give Arctic Fox a try. 
And I want to share the products I use to care for my hair one more time just because they really have saved my hair and have given me the ability to grow my hair out in a healthy way. Of course, if you bleach and dye your hair, you're going to get damaged. That's just inevitable. But the way you take care of it and the products you use will help keep your hair as healthy as possible so that you can continue to get to the length that you want. I started dyeing my hair back when I had a pixie cut. This is actually the longest my hair has been since high school, so I'm used to having very, very short hair. So I think using these products is what has really helped me be able to grow up my hair to be this long and keep bleaching and dyeing it. So again, here is the shampoo and conditioner I use. It is from Olaplex, and these just really keep your hair really healthy. It repairs and strengthens it. Usually I will get like a lot of breakage, and I still kind of do from the damage, but this really helps tone it down and just keep my hair healthy and strong through all of the bleaching and dyeing that I do to it. And they also smell really, really nice. And finally, the last hair health and styling product I used was this Olaplex bonding oil. Again, as you can tell, I've gone through a lot of it, but I actually remember <laughs> back in the before times, I remember I bought this in person at a mall, which means I bought this before COVID hit. So I've had this for probably more than a year at this point, and I still have like a really good amount left. You don't need to use a lot. I just put like a few little dabs on my fingers and I'll rub them together and just like comb it through my hair. So if you are looking to bleach and dye your hair a vivid color like this, I definitely recommend the products that I just mentioned. All of these were recommended to me by my amazing hairstylist, Amanda. Amanda, thank you so much for taking such good care of my hair and keeping me looking kawaii. She does have an Instagram where she does absolutely incredible hair art. I will put up some of my very favorite works of hers right here. If you love cool hairstyles and vibrant colors, please go check out her Instagram. She is a true artist. She did just also launch her own website and her knowledge is honestly priceless. It's what's kept my hair healthy. And if you would like to try Olaplex for yourself, I believe on her blog, she actually has a code to get you free shipping on your first try of Olaplex products. So if you want to give them a try yourself, head over to her blog and check out the code to get you some free shipping. I think that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for spending some time with me on my channel. And if you enjoyed it, please consider hitting that subscribe button down below and thumbs up. It really helps me out and I appreciate it so much. And also don't forget to go check out Amanda's Instagram and website. I will have them both linked below for you guys. Well, I'm going to end it here. I'm going to go enjoy the rest of my day with my fabulous newly dyed hair. I hope you enjoy the rest of yours as well, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!